I think I've gotten something which may have been a Kickstarter stroke Indiegogo project. Um, I've forgotten vaguely what this is, but it does say MaxiSense A010. And I think if I require, if I recall correctly, this was a depth camera. So this could be quite exciting. I'm trying to do this one handed. I really should be using a uh, camera stand so I can use two hands. So frustration free packaging here, huh? Um, let's have a look at what we've got in there. Yeah, you know, Maxi Sense A to A010. So it's a 2.5 meter distance 3D time of flight sensor. Okay, but this is the thing, it's 100 by 100 resolution. So as opposed to all those time of flight distance sensors, both uh, optical and uh, sound based, instead of it being maybe a 5x5 five five grid or just a single sensor, this is 100 by 100. So it's like a depth camera. This could be quite awesome on a robot. Now, I'll admit, I've still not really connected the LD7 distance sensor, which I had, which was like a line distance sensor, as in multiple entries. So, with the work on the book, I'm not sure when I'm going to get to play with it. Frustrating, but it's still kind of exciting. That's what we've got in here. We have USB. That's USB-C. Okay. Got... I guess what some kind of yeah there we go adapter to the connector that looks is that similar to the Grove format connectors okay don't know uh, that's the sensor is it oh I see there's an L LCD LCD there's going to be an OLED on the back it's not been LCD for a long time has it um Sipheed Sipheed okay branding Got what appear to be clips here that might open the thing up. Is that some kind of reset button? There's your connectors, so four pin, maybe some kind of UART and USB-C. My expectation is you'd program it over USB-C and maybe visualize it there as well. Um, and on the back here, uh, and then select data that you'd send over the UART with that, maybe. Um, or maybe that's not UART, maybe that's uh, I2C. I have to read the docs. Um, Okay, that's all we've got. It does come in a nice handy project box. I like that. I'll keep it with this. And okay, I'll keep the USB-C with it. But it's just standard USB-C. Right, well, not going to get to plug that in just yet. But this is exciting.